Many people in Washington, D.C. came out to vote for the 2012 presidential election. They expressed what they wanted in the next president of the United States. I really want him to act upon his integrity, act upon his values, his standards. I mean, the most important thing to me is that we elect someone who is responsible, who is really invested in the interests of everyone in the country and in the world. And it would mean a lot to me if there was more openness and more attention to respecting and acknowledging how many different definitions there can be for what a family is. This year, the district contains 143 various locations to vote. Many feel that waiting in long lines should not be an excuse to not vote. Um, it took really long. My teacher actually let us out of class early to come down here. And I've been down here from 1.30 and looking at my clock right now, it's about 4.28. So that's about three hours that I've been in there trying to vote. And I just felt as though they were just mad, understaffed, disorganized. People were cutting in line. It's just, I just felt as though it could have been a lot more organized. A lot of people are sticky, sticking it out because they know it's important. But I mean, a lot of people also have been like, oh, I have to go to class or I don't have time to do this or I'll just come back later. And, you know, maybe they won't come back. People throughout the district are coming together to choose the next president of the United States of America and make sure that whoever it is has their best interests at heart. I am Alyssa Louise McCall with Spotlight Network.